Hello, my name is Matt Kirksey, and I am the Associate Director of the Student Financial Aid Office here at the University of Akron. Today, I wanted to share with you some highlights of our office, other important information that you'll need to know as an incoming freshman, and finally, several ways to contact us if you have questions regarding your financial aid. First, a few highlights. We are proud of the fact that over 90% of our typical incoming freshman class will utilize some form of financial aid, whether that be a federal or state grant, federal work study, a scholarship from the university or an outside source, or a student loan. We process thousands of applications each month on average in order to ensure that our eligible students have access to these very important sources of funding, which makes obtaining their degrees more affordable. Our office can assist you from start to finish throughout the financial aid process. Now let's talk about some tips you'll need to know regarding your financial aid experience. If you would like to be considered for financial aid, your first step is to complete the free application for federal student aid, which is better known as a FAFSA. Many of you have already completed this step since the FAFSA first becomes available on October 1st of your senior year of high school. Our priority deadline at the University of Akron for FAFSA submission is always December 1st. However, even if you have not yet finished your FAFSA, it is not too late to apply. Keep in mind, you will need to complete this financial aid process annually and not just for your first year of school. To submit a FAFSA, you'll want to have a few things handy first. Number one, create an FSA ID for yourself and at least one parent. This is a username and password that you will use to sign and submit your application electronically. Number two, income information for yourself and your parent. In order to know what year income information you will need, think back two years. We call this prior prior year. For example, if you start college in 2020, you will need the income records from 2018. It's a good idea to have any tax returns and W-2s in front of you when you begin your FAFSA. Number three, you'll want to have personal details like you and your parents, social security numbers, birthdays, approximate account balances, and even wedding and separation dates handy as you begin your FAFSA as well. After you submit your FAFSA, keep an eye out for any document requests from us as sometimes we are required to collect additional information in order to finalize your application. We typically begin mailing our financial aid offer letters in early spring of each year. Let's switch gears to scholarships. These are a form of gift aid, which means the more you receive, the more affordable your education becomes. The University of Akron automatically considers each incoming student who applies for admission for our Akron Guarantee Scholarship. This program is based on your GPA and test scores submitted during the admissions process. The Akron Guarantee is a renewable scholarship with the potential to grow over the years as you progress toward graduation. We also have several scholarship opportunities with their own separate applications, either through our office or through one of our academic colleges or through another unit on campus such as BAND, ROTC, and Choose Ohio First, for example. You can find out more details regarding these scholarship programs offered by the university on our website. The final tip I want to share with you is this. We are aware that families' financial situations are fluid, especially right now. Although the FAFSA does ask for prior prior year income, if your household income has changed significantly since then, we do have a special circumstance review process that you will need to complete to make us aware of that. You will find that document along with more explanation of the process in the forms section of our website on our financial aid homepage. Now on to how you can reach us if you have questions. You'll be happy to know that the Financial Aid Support Center offers 24-7, 365 support to our students and their families. We are available by phone and live chat, and we also have an extensive frequently asked questions section where you can find the answers to generally every question you may have. Keep in mind that in order for us to speak with anyone besides you on your behalf regarding your financial aid, you will need to give us permission to do so. 
You can set this authorization up online within your student center in advance before you have the third party contact us. You'll find that option in your My Akron account. I hope this information was helpful and gave you a good overview of financial aid. We have additional videos with more detail on our University of Akron Facebook page, so be sure to check those out. I'm looking forward to seeing you on campus soon.